version of it back in 2019 here at Burns Night. Um, but um, I would guess most people either didn't listen or have forgotten it by now. <laughs> so if I don't mention it, nobody will know. So this is called The Beast of Wicks. <laughs> In the darkest depths of Essexshire, a monster was on the prowl. On many a chill and moonless night, you'd hear his blood-curdling howl. Was it a hound from hell itself? A werewolf? Perhaps a dragon? What was it that the locals feared as they cowered down the wagon? <laughs> Why did they dread their short walk home? What terror stalked the streets? And kept them in the pub till dawn, too afraid to leave their seats. It was the wild, flesh-eating haggis that was playing his be beastly tricks. As each night it wasted, waited in the gloom to feast on the folk of woods. At last they said they'd had enough, no longer would they live in fear. To be trapped there in the pub each night and be forced to drink Mark's beer. <laughs> <laughs> From their midst there stepped a Scotsman. Brave Sir Cameron was his name. Oh. Hooray! Yeah. He said, I know what must be done. I, that haggis, it must be slain. He put down his glass, went out alone. From the danger he'd not shrink. Yes, that night was a legend born. A Scotsman left a drink. Oh, he speaks not of his heroic deeds, of how the haggis met its fate. But suffice to say, his vanquished foe is now lay upon your plate. <laughs> but if you go walking home tonight, be wary, <clears throat> take great care. For though the beast of wicks is no more, its mother's still out there <laughs> somewhere. <laughs>